I fell on my crinkling butt, like always when I've lost my balance, but I wasn't too satisfied about it. Damn it, I wanted to walk, because that made so much fun. There were tears in my eyes and my thumb has found a way into my gaping mouth. I felt so sad. The fall didn't hurt at all, thanks to my comfy diaper, and my honesty held everything in place, but I was sad about it, like always. But there was one thing I could do, to cheer me up. And I did it. This moment was like always the best. I stared into the distance and it has eased my day for quite a moment. The flowing sensation ended sometime and I looked at the door in front of me. There was something I still needed to do. Yeah, I needed the potty. Urgently. I should better move on. There was nothing to hold on and I wasn't sure if I should try to walk again. So I placed my hands in front of me and moved on on my hands and knees. It wasn't that easy to move my body forward, due to the thick padding between my legs, but I crawled, like always, in joy and listened to the funny crinkling of my diaper. I wasn't sure, if the diaper made all the crinkling, but I knew, that it rustled when I moved my body. It was a normal sound for me, like the squishy warm feeling between my legs. I crawled and crawled, more than I always did, but finally I've reached the door. There I sat down and looked at the closed door, and somehow I knew, what I had to do. I've seen it many times before. It had something to do with this shiny thing. I always wondered, how it has worked, and I always wanted to grab it. I just like shiny things. So I sat up on my knees and lifted my padded rump a bit, to reach the handle with my outstretched hands. But then I thought, that it was broken, somehow, because it bowed down in my hands. I don't know why, but I tried to pull it, and nearly fell over, as the door flew open. First I was surprised, but then I thought about it. I still had something to do. I had to potty. And I moved on and tried to slip through the gap. But I was so proud, that I managed to open the door, that I didn't take care about things in front of me. It was hard enough for me, to hold back this inner urge, and I really really had to go. But the fate beat me.